Hello and good morning. Today we will be discussing the topic multiplication. Now before starting, let us discuss some important terms. The number to be multiplied is called multiplicand. The number by which we multiply is called the multiplier. And the result of the multiplication is known as product. Properties of multiplication Property number 1 Order property It states that the product of two numbers does not change when the order of the number is changed. For example, 5 into 3 is equal to 3 into 5. That means both will give us the answer 15. Property number 2 Grouping property It states that the product of the numbers does not change when the grouping of the numbers is changed. For example, 3 into in bracket 2 multiplied by 4 will be same as in bracket 3 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 4 which will be equal to 24. Property number 3 Distributive property of multiplication over addition let us understand it with an example. 6 multiplied by in brackets 3 plus 7 is equal to 6 multiplied by 3 plus 6 multiplied by 7 which is equal to 60. That means if we multiply 6 by the sum of 7 and 3 or if we multiply 6 separately with 3 and separately with 7 and after addition the answer will remain the same. Now, the next property. Multiplication property of 1. It states that any number multiplied by the number 1 will give us the number itself. Then comes the next property. Multiplication property of 0. It states that any number multiplied by 0 will always give us the answer 0. Multiplication by 10, 100, 1000. Suppose we want to multiply by 10, we will insert 10 after the given number. For example, 2345 multiplied by 10, simply the answer will be 23450. If we want to multiply by 100, we will repeat the same procedure but we will insert two zeros here. That means, for example, if a number 2, 3, 4, 5 has to be multiplied by 100, then the answer will be 2, 3, 4, 5, 0, 0.